Hi guys and welcome to the Android Tutorial YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you Waze on Android Auto and I am super excited about this. This is the first day on the stable version and I have been testing it over two months now. Um, it has been on the beta and I was part of the beta and everything and I have been able to provide feedback and so on. So I'm very excited to show you how Waze works in Android Auto. So as you can see here, uh, you got both options, Waze and Google Maps. Of course, I'm gonna choose Waze this time. And the standard interface comes up. As you can see, it's quite uh, similar to what the app in the cell phone gives us in the smartphone. Um, it has the very same graphics, standardized cartoon graphics. And um, you could see, um, well, let's start here. From the side, you're able to set up your home and work. So you're able to do that from your phone only. Uh, all your favorites are gonna be there. So for example, you could see here that I have um, information, uh, gas stations, and I don't have any favorites right now. I just rebooted my phone, but they would appear here. Um, on this side, you would be able to see uh, normal regular waste stuff so for example police traffic if there's a crash if there's a map issue you could report it from here if there's a hazard or a camera um, you're able to report it so that's very very nice um, last but not least you have two options in order to search first one would be a keyboard which will only work if you're not moving so if you're moving this keyboard would be disabled and it would say stop in order to uh, type. So I'm gonna type in, I don't know, McDonald's. So as you can see, um, I started typing in McDonald's and it came up with a lot of searches. I'm able to click on this one, for example, and it's gonna calculate the route. Okay, so it's gonna say how many meters if well depending on your location it's gonna say the street name and you gotta um, turn right or turn left um, it says that my approximate time of arrival would be 10 4 p.m. it would be about 26 kilometers and 34 minutes so that's quite standard from here you're able to click on sound so we got the standard ones um, alerts only sound off and sound on um you also get well you're also able to do that kind of stuff if you see a hazard uh, you're also gonna be able to find the routes so you can see here that you got three different routes and you're able to click on uh, the one you would like uh, depending on where uh, you want to go and um last one would be stop navigation so it would take you back in order to look for other one so the other second um option in order to search would be through the microphone mcdonald's okay so you could see basically that there are the same results and you could do it both ways it all depends on um how hard would it be for the engine to recognize your voice so you could do it both, both ways and I am pretty excited that uh, they included that so this was a very very quick look on how Waze looks for Android Auto um, if you have any question leave your question on the comments and I will be more than glad to assist you with it so if you like this video subscribe like share and uh, we'll see you in the next video bye